What's going on YouTube? My name is Diesel and today we're checking out a brand new game. Small land. Small small land. Small land. No end that. Small land? No end that. Survive the wilds. It's like grounded. You're a tiny little creature, little wood nymph, rolling around a gigantic set of woods, ladybugs, cockroaches, geckos, the works. Everything's giant, everything's terrifying, and I guarantee you there's a big old spider. Intrepid vanguards, your queen is ill, gravely ill. This is why, as your king, I am asking for your help. Venture into the overland and seek out a cure. Whatever the cost, be bold, be brave, remain vigilant. From King Valdemar's speech to the vanguard corpse. Who, who's that? Look at me. Wild looking. Check it out. Pretty. Greetings, I've been tasked with meeting all Vanguard before they leave the burrows as I have crucial information to impart. Yeah, I have a quick question. How do we get so small? Keep an eye trained for these owl effigies. Okay. They are scattered throughout the area and provide useful hints and tips to help you survive. Outside, you'll find Captain Herner, who will help you in your first days outside the burrows. Thank you. Where am I again? All right, so I'm seeing that I'm comfortable in the bottom left. Got have water, got some health. Great. Hey, I'm gathering bean sprouts over here, some fibers. It's good to have some fiber in our, in our diet. Gather some wood. We can now build things. We're gods. What is this? Oh, look at that. Gotta get all the loot. Just gotta get all the loot. Gotta gather it all. Never know. Don't never know when we're gonna need it. Trying to build a hut? Effigy, pedigree, pillagey, effigy. Owl effigies and compendium. Compendium! When you examine an owl effigy, it reveals useful pieces of advice. This info is automatically logged into your compendium, which you can access at any time from the inventory menu. Press tab, open the inventory menu. Talkie talkie and we're talkie, sure. Ah, in compendium. Got some fiber. Da, wood, resin, mushroom steak, necessary. Simple bandage, good, and a wooden club. Well, let's just put that bad boy right there. What are you saying there, pal? What are you saying there, pal? You never know. Is this crafting menu? Oh, a wood hatchet? Can I just, can I just make one of these? I just, uh, I think I just did. Unknowingly. I did. Aha! <laughs> We're so smart. The Burrows is an extensive network of underground tunnels and caverns that is home to the small folk. <laughs> this is a little small folk. The tunnels are incredibly intricate with multiple levels and branching paths that stretch for hundreds of yards in all directions. They are lit. I can guarantee you that. Glowing crystal lamps and makeshift torches creating a warm, inviting atmosphere. I'm hearing some hard work being done here. Insect eggs, yes. Sentinel aid. You got me. My wife can make a mean pixie omelet. Yes, she can. She made it for me one day after I was leaving in the morning. I'm sorry, what? You heard me. All right. Uh oh. Going out into the wild. Captain Heron, eh? Is stationed downhill from here. You should go and introduce yourself. Don't tell me what to do. Okay, looks like we got a map, too. Oh, look at you. We need to go to Heron, Heron, Heron. So Heron. Oh, me so Heron. Uh uh, me so Heron. So I take it this is like the starting area. And it's going to be like, granted, this is not really detailed a whole lot. It's like, hey, just giving you an idea of where you are on the map, I suppose, but I guess, I guess, I, I suppose, I guess. Yo, Captain Harney. Is that you? Gathering all the fibers. Don't even know if I need it. Armor provides protection against different types of damage and can also keep uh, you warm in cold weather. Some settlers in the overland have the expertise to make new sets of armor for you, provided you give them the required materials. Captain Harney. Greetings, Vanguard. Welcome to the Overland. I'm Captain Ernest Manicavi. But most small folks just call me Herney. Oh, hey, what's going on? Uh, can I ask you some questions? Why can I craft some armor? Uh, sure, Vanguard, but you still have to bring me all the necessary materials. I would like to craft some armor. Yes. Please. Padded bracers. What's necessary for this? I need fiber? You need fiber. Good one, Diesel. How much fiber do I need to give you, bro? It's a lot of fiber. Okay, should have enough now for a pair of pants. 
You need that? Gotta hold it all in. I got myself a nice set of padded wraps, cold protection nine. You know, I guess to start off, it's good to stay warm, I suppose. Padded breeches, 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 breeches. Look at us now. My, my, my. How fast we grow. I love to make sure to eat and drink regularly. Being well nourished will uh, make you uh, more resilient and energetic, as well as stronger. Get some good food, raw food. Oh yeah, and some blueberries. Hey, you don't mind if I steal all your uh, food, huh? I was told to report you for my assignment. Ah yes, I've been expecting you. The elder Ludwig, <laughs> well, look him, has requested your presence. Go see him at once. He is staying in the cave just down the hill. Thank you, Captain. I think. Small folk are resourceful for people, tools, weapons, and food can be crafted out of materials in the overland. Thank you. Ooh, I, I know. A crafting. A crafting station. Compendium. What about building stuff? We're just cutting it hard. Cutting it real hard. What's going on, Alephagy? Stay away from deep water. Small folk can't swim. What do you mean we can't swim? What am I too dense as a small little tiny thing? Upon death, you will respawn at your activated bed or spawn location. A, a tombstone will appear when you die. Okay. What about like? Can I drink some water though? Get a little parched over here. Use up all my fiber making these, making this fresh gear. A walk aware. A lot of resin. Don't know what it does. Something tells me it's going to be necessary. Okay, what's in here? What's in here? Hello? Bro, you look wild. Can I have a sip of water? No? Vanguard, finally you're here. Elder, what are you doing in this overgrown cave? The jeweled clover key that unlocks the apothecary's chest has gone missing. I fear it may have been stolen. We are here trying to find some other means of opening the chest. What's in the box? Achievement, the elixir of life. He claimed it would heal any ailment known to small folk. Where would it go? The key was locked in the royal vault, which is always under heavy guard. Only the king and I are allowed entry. The theft was noticed when the queen became ill and the clover key was needed, but it could have happened some time ago. Who is the apothecary? Melka. The royal family's personal apothecary. This cave we're standing in was his personal laboratory here in the Overland. He would spend countless days searching the Overland for rare ingredients to use in his potions. Have you tried forcing the chest? We don't force things, okay? Ah, yes. We received troubling reports from the Overland settlers in the forest. It seems as though some of the creatures in the area have become unusually agitated and aggressive. That clover key, huh? You'll find the settlers scattered throughout the forest, so I have marked their locations on the map. Be careful, Vanguard. The wilderness is filled with danger. Erne and Kalev can help you survive out there. I shall leave you now. Hope you don't mind me stealing all of your things. Ah. This is where we need the clover key. Right. Handles. Back out into the wild. All right. So it's been marked. It has been, <laughs> has been, has been said. I don't see no friggin' marks. I got Kalev over here. Caleb. Caleb. And after all of that, is there any way I could learn how to drink water? Oh, jeez. Uh, oh, look at the butterflies. And pretty butterflies. There's a pretty girl there, eh? Precip uh, precipitation such as rain or snow can damage structures, so make sure your construction... Oh, so we have weather in this game. Interesting. Rain also plants mushrooms grow back faster after you harvest them. Furthermore, weather affects temperature, uh, so be sure to always wear the appropriate clothing. Right. 
How do I drink? Where must I go now? Kind of just going through the, the little area here. I'm pretty sure. Oh God. Take this ants. Get wrecked. Anybody else want to dance? What's up to Ladybug? You good? Ladybugs is good. Every single game, Ladybugs are the best. I just wanted to drink. There are five distinct weapon types in Vanguard can wield blunt... <laughs> What's up? Edged, piercing, poison, and fire. The creatures you encounter in the Overland have different strengths and weaknesses when it comes to each. Pay attention to the icon next to their health bar, which determines which weapon type would be more effective. Very good. Oh, we got a stream here. I'm kind of just going, like, overlooking some of this stuff. I just kind of need a... Get a lay of the land here. Like. Like, I know I can't swim. But I also need to drink. When you dismantle the structure, all the materials you... Yeah, cool. Um... Maybe I need to build a hammer. Builder's hammer, that is. And then we'll pop that here. And then if I have a three... Oh, campfire, workbench, simple bed, simple chest. Nifty. And now, if I want, I can build whatever I want. Oh, yeah, workbench, campfire, simple bed. How do I drink water, though? Kind of just going up this tree real quick. See where see where it takes me. See where it leads me. Ah, yeah, some more owls. Ooh, and berries. Hold on here a second. Um. Oh, okay. So the berries are what gives me a little bit of sustenance. That's cool. Good to know. Yeah. What about this stuff though? Bugsland. Thick, thick liquid extracted from insects that helps with cooling and hot weather and provides rapid hydration. Note to self, kill every single ant that you see. Come on. Bugs lymph. Edible mushrooms. We're gonna rip, bro. Ah. The Owl God. Sacred Owls. Small folk believe owls possess magical powers and worship them as some kind of divinity. Silly, silly, silly elves. Idol statues and decorations are crafted in their honor. Alright. This is wild, man. Structures. We have a simple chest. I don't know, workbench here. Collision. 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 Colliding. Look at this stone cutter. Stone cutter. Stone. Stone. Here, let's use this. So what else we have now? So we have a wood sword. Nice. Simple bows. Torches. Wood arrows. Pet, pet whistle. Yes, you can tame pets. Like pretty early on, apparently. Uh, a mandibular pickaxe. We get a bull ant. Root hatchet. Nah. Chitin. You gotta be chitin me. <laughs> uh, I'll tell you what. Let's get ourselves a nice simple bed. Simple. And right now we're comfortable, it seems like. Oh, well check this out. We got foundations. Ah, uh, look at this. Decorations. Wood chair. Interesting. Well, we're gonna have to do some gathering here. I need to be sheltered to sleep. I 
Alright, so we'll, we'll dismantle. A vine then. Uh, so does this go up any further? It does not. Alright, so go back down. There's some Mothras. Mothras. What is that? Why, hello there, is a cricket area? Hey, cricket. How are you? Don't want to fight you yet. 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 Alright, let's, let's build ourselves something real nice and real, real tidy. Just as a little starter base. Why not? Uh, let me see if I can snap. Oh, we can. Little platform right up here. Let's do a little 4x4. Four four. Why not? It's simple. It's easy. It's breezy. It's sleazy. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's about to rain. What are we to do? I like how you can angle these. This is nifty. But again, let's just keep it simple, stupid. Got some windows to the walls. Um, we have a little Harry Potter home, a little, little Hagrid home. And boom, haha, -ha, nice. Uh, do we have any special doors or stairs, twigs, leaves, stairs? No structural support. You don't have any structural support. That's the whole point. Boom. Done. We got a simple bed now. Look at this. We're gods. We built our first home. Rejoice. Now, as far as what we got here. I know I've got a bed. Simple bandage. Bandage, edible mushrooms. Um, I thought I made a simple. Oh wait, crafting. Gotcha. Simple bed. Shebang a bang. Workbench. Filling up a whole lot of space, but it's necessary. And let's get a simple chest. Where is it open? Probably this way. All right, let's put some of this stuff in here. Wait. FUs. Can we shift click over? Right click over. There we go. There we go. Get some resin. Throw some resin in there. Some insect eggs. We'll keep some of this with us because we need it to eat and drink. Be merry. Got some screws. An ant head, a sturdy grate for protection, yet deliciously crunchy when cooked. Gross. Okay, and a campfire, we'll put that down here. I kind of just extended this a little bit because I was a little cramped. Um, and I accidentally burst out this window. About to pop a bust. Boom, there we go. There we go. Now we're, we are sheltered. We're fancy. We'll lose some fancy free. Let's use. Oh, ant skewers. Let's do it. Insufficient materials. Look at this. We got ant skewers now. Kebabs, if you will. Kebabs. Can you believe it? Kebab nails. Uh, let's put all the stuff back in here. I just moved. I got a bottle cap. A strange object left by giants. Not giants. Can be processed in metal, used in stoneworking or machinery. Really? Well, that's good. Activate the spawn point, and now we're ready to explore this strange and crazy world. These little designs spawn. Guess I gotta go see Caleb. Whatever the hell that is. Wait, how does one traverse this great landscape? Um, look, we gotta go over here. I'm a madman. Give me your insides. Yeah. You know what? It's a celebration. I'm gonna 
eat you. Delicious. Health doesn't go up though, so this is just like straight up nourishment. All right. It's raining. By the way, these raindrops hurt like hell. <laughs> it's like you ever be, you ever go underneath a waterfall? I think they'll knock you on your ass. Oh, a mauve plant. Who'd hatch it or better? I got I got to hatch it right here. I need some chitin. Wherever I, wherever I can find chitin. Gotta get out these shrooms, kid. Oh yeah. Delicious. I do like that there's rain effects though. I do like... They got a little bit of weather. That's the one thing about Grounded that we were all kind of missing out on. It's just like... Weather changes. But of course... Everything would be super duper dark. Hi, Ladybug. Got an owl effigy over here. If you die, drop everything in your inventory except for what you were holding up or wearing. All is not lost. Gotcha. But I... Like, how do I get across, though? What's up, my guy? Guess we'll go say hi to him. Bull ant. Oh, nice. Nice. Yes. Hey, when it comes to making bandages, guess I gotta do that at a workbench. Right. Hey, I just beat up one of your brothers. What do you guys say about that? Punk? We've got one swinging motion. Get wrecked. We almost died there. <laughs> Everything's getting really quiet. Everything's very, very quiet. I have one HP in a dream. All right, we gotta get back. We gotta get out of here, or else I'm gonna die. Oh, okay. So we do gain some health back. Nice, 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 nice. And we are quite comfortable. It seems to be like 34 over time. Like it doesn't continue going. Like a game back a, a small percentage point. I don't think I'll be able to get over there. I don't think so. Let me know in the comment section down below. How do I get across this little creek? I, I would say river, but it's not really a river. It's more like a little babbling brook that to us seems just daunting. And I really hope I don't have to kill these, uh, wonderful ladybugs and get some chitin. I would hate to do that. I mean, I would hate that. Sarcasm. Well, look at our quaint, our quaint little, little cottage. Our quaint little cottage by the ocean. Ah, yes. Mushroom steaks. Ant skewers. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, workbench. Okay, so this is where we go to repair something nifty. Okay, so we can craft simple bandage. Gonna need a bunch of these. Just need fiber. Okay, so that's something with fiber. Mandible pickaxe. Alright, so we have mandibles. I just need fiber now. Got a wood sword, fiber and wood. Lovely wood sword. Crude hatchet. Ladybug travel kit. A kit includes a special treat to tame a ladybug. Oh, as well as backpacks designed to attach to their four way. Oh, so we can use the ladybugs as storage? We can. and, and mounts? I think I just fell in love with this game. We gotta get a sword though. Here. Get some fiber quick. Get some fiber in her diet. Now, of course, this game is multiplayer, so you can go ahead and hop in with your peoples, with your boys. And I have an open area service. We're definitely gonna have to play this. With our peoples. Alright, 
right, let's see what happens when we get ourselves a nice wooden sword. What do you say? Wood hatchet? Uh, we already have a wood hatchet. We need a crude hatchet. A mandible pickaxe? Sure, 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 sure. And also, we're probably going to need, like... This, this, this is not going to do. The setup. We're going to have to widen this out. I mean, we got to. It must be done. Or have, like, a separate building for these things. And now we have a sword. Okay, so we can take all of this. Got a crude hatchet. And we'll put the stakes all the way over at the end. Sounds good. Sounds good. All right, ants. Come meet your maker. Let's see how well this works out. I think it's, they're pretty, uh, pretty terrible. Pretty terrible. Oh, there's some nails. Oh, there's nails in the ground. Gotta get some stone now. Nice, we're in the stone age now. We're getting all sorts of achievements. That's the reason why you watch this cutting edge gameplay. Get some more nails in the ground. Sensational. But we need more rocks. To make our stone cutter. Stone cutter. Alright. Might as well get all the rest of the stone in here. I don't know if things uh, respawn or not. Again, if you have more hints, tips, and tricks, let me know in the comment section down below, or hop on to the Discord, discord.gg slash designs and let me know as well. Follow me on the tweeters. On the tweeters and everywhere. Why not? Eh? Come here, you punks. I now have a sword. Oh my god, I'm OP? I'm OP? Ants, what's good? Well, I fear no ant now. Mandible, some nails. Resins. You know, let's make a stone cutter. Oh, bottle cap and a screw. Hold on. Oh. Oh, look at this now. Apothecary table, tannery, covered bed, cauldron. You make all sorts of new things. Cover bed, I guess that's garlic leaf. Tannery, fiber, flint, refined wood. I had no idea how to make any of these. Apothecary table, refined wood, refined wood. Cauldron, refined wood. What are you talking about? All right, so we got stone spears, stone bricks, stone hammer, oil seed, refined. Ah, that's what you make. The we need seed oil. How do you make seed oil? Seeds. Get out of town. Flint hatchet. Flint spear. We're already upgrading to the tippy top of the best around. We have yet to kill too many things that... My friends will change. That there. Oh wait. I'm hitting I keep on hitting control shift. It's just right click. Wait, why is all the stuff on the ground? We're getting so advanced. You guys wanna start some ish? Oh, you got none of you stand a chance. None of you stand a chance. I'm just going to eat you. What's up here? Let's see what's cracking. Anybody want to say hi? Oh, we got some more ants. Oh, jeez. I think I found their lair. What's the matter? I can't hear you. Cause you're dead. Uh, this looks like an unfinished cave. It's all here for show. Don't tell anybody. Shh. <laughs> Ooh, a cave. Let's go in there. Game's like, no, not today. Now again, this is early access, so you might want to check it out. Link is going to be in the description down below. But I'll tell you what, it is pretty looking. It is. Very lovely to the eyes. The action seems pretty smooth as well. It could use a little bit of optimization. Just a bit. Strawberries. Need a wood hatchet or better. Dang. What's good? What's good? Yo, I aggroed this from a ton away. Just one shot in these clowns now. 
Oh, I guess I found their home, their lair, their place of residence, their home away from home. Their peace, their resistance. What is this? An electrical socket, a little, little switch. Any harvest this? Anything else? Looks like we got a nice place for stone. Where does it lead? Out the other side. Hey, guys. I was just in your house. By the way, you're filthy. And you're dead. <laughs> but yeah, it's definitely a run around, mess around, gather up everything, build them up, do everything you can to get the, the most, the most stuff you can. Destroy all the ants. They're worthless. They mean nothing. They're useless. They're only here to feed me. But we need to start making wood hatchets and stuff like that. What's going on, bull ant? Whoa, 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 whoa. Yo, we are gods now. The sword is OP. The sword is OP. But apparently I'm in friggin' Deathland. Oh wow, I'm all the way up here. Oh well. Let's start to head back. What do you say, everybody? What do you say? We got a bunch of bunch of food. We're exploring a little bit. I see that we're gonna need a wood hatchet to chop down some of these things. It's probably gonna give us seeds and make seed oil. I'm just guessing. Yeah. Rye. Nice. There is one thing that I wish it would have, though, and that's... Oh, I'm just going deeper into the belly of the beast here. Is, uh, like, in the game Grounded, there's no... Like, the, they have a dandelion, like, some sort of consumable that I can just, like, float down if I wanted to. No, they don't got that in this. Now, they do have a glider, eventually, but it's, like, more towards, like, later game... Later game type stuff. And since I have no map knowledge, I'm just running around not knowing what what to do, where to go, how to get back. I think this is literally the entrance to the entire game. <laughs> yep, there's our there's our stuff down there. Or there's Herony. Herony, Herony, Herony. Uh-huh, miso Herony. Uh-huh, miso Herony. So I end it's starting to rain again. But we're back home. And now we're better for it. Ah, yeah. It's got to cook up some of them ant mandible, baby. You have some ant skewers. Delicious. And nutritious. And abundant, too. Go ahead. Eat it up. Awesome. Quite quaint. Quite lovely. And we're going to have to get some more bandages. The bandages are going to be something we definitely need to get our hands on. A wood hatchet. I thought of a hat. Like, what? what is this? A wood hatchet. I need a crude hatchet. I need some chitin. I got to do some research. I got to do some research. But folks, that is going to be your episode for today. This game's pretty dope. I'd like to hop on in, maybe do a live stream, get some peoples in here. Got a lot of multiplayer games that we are about to hit up, including some single-player games, so make sure you hit that bell notification and be aware of all the stuff that we drop. In a little house. It's a little cozy, cozy place by the by the stream. It's nice. But folks, if you enjoyed this video, by all means, hit that like button, help some channel ever so much more new, and if you like it a whole lot, go ahead, hit subscribe. New videos come out every single day, live streams every week. Make sure you hit the bell notification and be aware of all the new content, everyone. Peace out, I shout y'all, and I'll check you out right here again. In small land. Next time. Look at all the butterflies. It's very pretty.